Hi everyone, uh, my name is Neeraj. Today we are going to have a discussion or I should rather say a training on soft skills. Many of you would be knowing about this term. Uh, presently we are uh, using this term in a huge aspects but initially people were not aware about this. When we talk about soft skills, now let's dis start discussing about soft skills. Okay, I have a better idea like when you don't have something in you then you better understand the feeling of not having that particular thing so we will move in that direction like if i would be out and make you understand if a person is not having soft skill what can happen to that person okay so i would be using something okay now we should understand that that is it it is soft skills okay this is the thing if a person is not going to have that what can happen with that person if a person is not going to have a soft skill the person is lacking with knowledge the secondly the knowledge will lead less knowledge will lead to lack of confidence these two things like the, if a person is not having soft skill the person is uh, lacking with the knowledge and if a person is not having any knowledge of anything the person is not having confidence because when uh, i will give you an example of a class when you start asking questions when your teacher or your trainer start asking questions to to you people publicly or in a training process or in a class or in a lecture what happens when he or she starts asking so if even though you are knowing the answer you are not capable enough to speak up with the answers when what do you see when the person jo aapke bagal mein baitha hai the person gave you the answer then you start thinking okay uh, i missed it i was knowing the answer but i could not speak because i am lacking with the confidence so even you though you are having knowledge you would not be able uh, confident enough to speak up so self skill gives you the confidence okay then only you will be able to speak so your self confidence would also give you a interest on uh, you people so you should better understand that what is the importance of knowledge okay so if a person is not having soft skill the person is not having confidence and the person would not be any uh, interest or any like uh, i should say having any interest in knowledge getting the knowledge or exploring himself or herself towards a education field or towards anything okay if a person the fourth one is the lack of value among friends groups and society okay thing is that why i have added friends groups and society in a sequence way if a person is having lots uh, like lack of confidence lack of knowledge person would not be able to create a value in uh, among friends groups and society this is a common phenomenon here i am speaking about the knowledge and confidence it is it starts with your friends the value value you know every must um, everyone must be knowing what value wherever you are in from which background you belong you need to create a value if you are not having soft skill you will not be able to create a value like we roam around with friends initially in our society in our groups if a person like no ek normal example dunga aap jaise apne group mein rehte hain theek hai to koi new person aapko kisi friend se introduce karata hai that person involves in your group and start using vulgar language what is your idea start generating about that person oh this person is not so good he is not having a proper value in the society that's why he is using this kind of language so first of all your value decreases when you start speaking so if you are not having soft skills the person the value you will not be able to create among friends okay this would also in uh, uh, move to the groups and the society i have used society here like aap log kabhi ghar mein rehte hain society mein rehte hain jis locality mein rehte hain group friend ke sath aap 
किसी सोसाइटी में अपनी सोसाइटी में चार पांच लड़के लड़कियों के साथ अपने बैठे हुए खड़े वेन एवर आ सीनियर पर्सन सीनियर सिटीजन आई सुड से लाइक मोहल्ले के अंकल आंटी या दादा दादी बाहर बगल से गुजर रहे हैं तो वट यू डू वेन यू यू आर टॉकिंग विथ योर अमाउंट फ्रेंड वेरी फ्रिक्वेंटली वेन दे जस्ट क्रॉस इज यू वट यू डू जनरली क्या करते हैं आप आप थोड़े शांत हो जाते हैं थोड़ा सा उनको वैल्यू देते हैं तो आप धीरे धीरे बोलते हैं आपकी बॉडी लैंग्वेज चेंज हो जाती है इट मीन्स आप वहाँ अपना वैल्यू क्रिएट कर देते हैं तो आपकी जो सोसाइटी है वहीं से स्टार्ट होती है यानी वो सीनियर सिटीजन वो जो अंकल आंटी हैं या जो भी हैं सीनियर पर्सन है उनको आपने एक वैल्यू दिया तो दे स्टार्ट डिस्कसिंग एमंग देयर देयर ग्रुप्स ओके दिस इज अ गुड पर्सन ये इनकी सोसाइटी अच्छी है इनका ग्रुप अच्छा है ये लोग बिहेवियर जानते हैं एटिकेट्स जानते हैं तो वहाँ से आपकी वैल्यू क्रिएट होती है तो सॉफ्ट स्किल आल्सो इन्वॉल्व दी एटिकेट्स इट स्टार्ट्स विद दी नॉलेज कॉन्फिडेंस योर कम्युनिकेशन स्किल देन स्टार्ट्स विथ योर एटिकेट्स हाउ मच यू आर एबल टू बिहेव इन फ्रंट ऑफ अदर्स दैट इज योर एटिकेट्स ओके दैट लास्ट वन इज लैक ऑफ वैल्यू लैक ऑफ वर्क This is the very more important thing. If you are not having a proper soft skill, you will not be getting work. Because soft skill starts with your knowledge, confidence, then your communication skill, then etiquette. Following these things, you would get work. Because until unless you are not going to create a recognition in the society, in uh, value in the society, you will not be getting. the proper work or without work you are nothing okay so this is soft skill like uh, now you have understood the better idea you have understood and now you are having a better idea like if a person is not having soft skill these things can happen with them okay one more thing lack of recognition as well okay now we would start discussing about the soft skill so you now understood like first and foremost thing is the communication skill then your uh, uh, personality then it involves various other things as well so we would be later discussing on all other aspects of the soft skill this is the initial beginning okay thank you ठीक से किए